Alright guys, just got my uh, two cups of oatmeal cooking. Gonna cook up this tilapia. And my sweet potatoes are done. And yesterday's YouTube video is uploading. Alright guys, I'm just cooking up six tilapia fillets right now. Just for my meals for the day. Just adding some uh, real lemon lemon juice to them. I find it makes them taste a little bit better. And then I'm adding some garlic powder. And that should be it. Now I'll come back when it's all cooked up and in my containers. What's up guys, just uh, on the way to Denny's right now. Just gonna go grab some breakfast with the girl and her friends. Um, later on we're gonna hit a back day. It's gonna be a pretty decent pull day, even for um, hyper back day. So let's, let's get it and let's get uh, a lot of lats in there today. Get that volume in, get those lats pumped up. A really good bump, really good pump. Chase it. And uh, we'll hit some biceps as well. Gonna try a few different exercises that I haven't tried. Um, and we'll see how that goes, and basically will be it. Accidentally hit the horn. <laughs> so yeah, see you guys there. Well, everybody's got everything okay? I think so. Yeah. yeah. Hey guys, on the way to the gym right now. Gonna hit that pole day. It's gonna be a good one. Enjoy the footage. You go, I go. You stay, I stay, one song you sing. Alright, what's up guys? Checking in for another video. It was a pull day and we hit some back and biceps. Uh, just doing this row machine, I only included one clip of this. Uh, I had 325s on and a 35 on the weight each side. Moving on to some, this is my second working set of uh, it's kind of like seated rows on this hammer strike machine. The weight on this right now is a plate 25. Um, I did the two sets after this going up to two plates and 35. Really focus on getting that contraction and stretch. <clears throat> then I moved on to some plenly rows. These were, this was my uh, second working set. I'm only including my working sets guys because I don't want the videos to be super super long because there's just, it's just boring like that, so just including my main working sets, and I might play around with it a bit more in the future. But yeah, these started getting into a pretty big grind after the other stuff I did, so especially because I did legs yesterday, my hamstrings were just on fire. I just threw this clip in here just because, and this is a squat rack, I just decided to do some wide grip pull-ups on it. Like four reps, I think. Four or five reps. Surprisingly hard, actually. And I moved on to some lap pull down. I think this was 120 pounds. Um, this was my warm up set, kind of first warm up slash working set. Um, really trying to bring up my last guys, trying to get that width in my back as well as um, just being over a little wide. <coughs> and I think this moved on to 140 pounds, I think. It might still be 120, I'm not sure. There was a set that I went up to 140 and I did that for three sets of seven. Yes, this is the working set with 140. I did four total sets of 140. So that was eight reps for that set. Um, and then I moved just on to some dumbbell bent over rows, single arm. I think this weight was 55 pounds. I was really grinding at this part of the workout. I was super tired and fatigued, but I still pushed through it. I think I stuck with this weight for two to three sets and then I bumped it up to 
I think, 75 pounds. Just another set here with 55 pounds. Yeah, I just weighed myself this evening uh, that I took this video. Um, and I weighed in at 199.5. I woke up today, with where, which is where I'm recording this video. And I weighed myself in at 195.9. So it was only a three pound difference almost between uh, evening weight and morning weight. So I moved on to some bicep curls, just alternating, and then I, once uh, the regular bicep curls got fatigued out, I just went into some hammers, just to get those extra few reps in while in that fatigue mode. Really loving my serratus development too, you can definitely see that quite a bit. Is the, I think this was my fourth set of curls. I did about four to five sets of these while moving into a hammer strength. Well, not hammer strength, sorry. Um, hammer curl right afterwards. Hammer curls are good, guys, because they not only do they work the length of the bicep, but they also work your forearms. But I find in order to incorporate more forearm, you really have you'll you'll definitely feel your uh, forearm starting to fire. And here I just did some really slow negatives for this set. Moved on to some hammers right here. So hammers work the length of the bicep while curls, if you turn your pinky in, like you turn your pinky outwards as you bring the weight up, it works more of the peak of your bicep. I moved into some uh, incline um, dumbbell curls, really focusing on just the stretch at the bottom, bringing the weight up slowly and contracting. When you release the weight to the bottom on this exercise, guys, it really gets that bicep stretched out. It's almost, you, it's almost like you're contracting your tricep at the bottom just to force that extra stretch. And another clip of this from the side view, stretching the bicep out a lot, coming up nice and slow. Really focusing on controlling that weight it's all about that time under tension, guys. Yeah, these are absolutely killer. These just got like my bicep firing. I got a huge pump off these, which is a good thing. Grinding out that last rep. And then I moved on to some incline single arm, I'm not even sure what these are called actually, incline single arm curls, but technically on a decline angle. Anyways, these work a lot of your peak if you turn your wrist outward at the very top of the movement. I think I did about three to four sets of this with six to eight reps after this working set. I hate the lighting in our gym with the orange walls. You just you just look so orange. It's ridiculous. But, oh well. That's it, guys. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the footage. Um, I'm also playing around with that commentary a bit, so I hope you guys enjoy that. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. So I'll edit this video later tonight and throw it up. Go watch my leg day video from yesterday. Give that a thumbs up. Share it. Subscribe. Appreciate it, guys. All right, guys, we're at the kangaroo farm now. Um, 
Gonna see some baby roos, right? Oh yeah. Baby Still sipping on at Minos. Where are we going? What other what other animals do they have here? Um, pigs and pigs? peacocks. Peacocks. And right. duck capybaras. Over there. Capybaras, which I don't think I'm gonna see right now. You can put in my ball. What? Well, that's what you're supposed to do down the other. Go for it. It's an emu. Oh, she is brave enough. Look at the peacock right there. At least you go pet it. Not petting that one. Let's go over to the big one. Come over to the big one. Hold this. Can I hold it? Mm-hmm. Let's go over this one. Do you think they will bite you? I'm pretty sure it said don't pet the peacock. It's not a peacock. Oh, well. They're so little. Well, Look at this little guy. So weird. I'm guessing that's mama, and these are the babies. <laughs> they're so like, they're so lazy. Do they ever like walk around? They're huge. You can go ahead. Yeah. I need more food. It's totally got a baby in there. Is the feet sticking out? Yeah. yeah. On the tail. Go pet him. I don't want to pet him. Why? He's walking by. Where's he attacking? See? He's, he's scoping out the competition. Okay. See ya. See? He's on. Balance is on his head. I wonder how old he is. He looks old. There's all those. Let's go look. This one laying on the ground. Remember last year? Hey, buds. There's a huge albino one over here. Let's go look at this one. doing? This one's not photogenic, it just keeps looking away. <laughs> what are you doing? There's a leaf right there if you did that one. This one? Want this one? Some leaf. Nothing exciting. Uh -huh. Seems like it. Hi, Ernie. Okay, thanks. He's throwing. He like devoured that leaf. Jeez. <laughs> He's a wolf. Are those actually good? I feel like they're not. Can you
Come here, buddy. Nope. Nope. He just wants to walk away. Hey. Is this sleeping? Is that a duck? It's a duck, yes it is. That's funny. Ew. Yeah. That's weird. Look at that guy. Oh, the pig's coming. I need another selfie. Both these chickens are really photogenic. <laughs> They're just chilling. Look at this guy. What's up? What's up? <laughs> Come here. Wow! Oh. <laughs>